all right, so I'm actually kind of excited. I love my Vista glass, but right now I don't have any Vista beer. But it's a tall glass, and it needs to be filled. And the only fill that can fill it is big shoes, clown shoes, as a matter of fact. Um, yeah, I don't know how they thought of their name. I remember I read up on it, but it's like that's the one you stuck with. And every piece of art is supposed to have clown shoes on it i think if you see his feet on the bottom every single piece of art has it in there uh, but this is from their uh is it luchador series it's a good style a little bit of cinnamon so it makes it make it mexican style it's really smooth dark perfect amount of cinnamon very savory really good and they come in tall boys this one though is the pumpkin one <laughs> so it's a pumpkin sombrero bang Mexican style chocolate style with pumpkin puree. So there is real pumpkin in here in case you're wondering. All right, let's see if this pour goes down well. Yeah. All right, so far. All right, maybe, maybe want a little more fizz. There we go, real quick. Oh, oh. Now that is a full glass. Oh, baby. Sorry, I don't know. Start sneezing. But the show must go on. Yep, very dark, sweet, slight booziness. I keep forgetting to look at the ABV. Some will have ABV, usually they have it. 7%, so that's a good one. Comes in a four pack. They are a little pricey, but they make quality beer. So always know they make quality beer. It's worth the dollars that you gotta put in for it, promise you. Um, I drink them here and there, depending on the style. They got some really good ones. They have got more than just stouts, but they do have a lot of mean stouts, beautiful stouts. So if you happen to be a stout lover, you have to check them out or you need to check them out. Yep, subtle. The pumpkin is real nice. It's very, uh, more and more uh, fresh, I guess. That's the word. I don't know. It's, it just feels like it's outdoor breezy type deal. Like I said, super dark, but light. the body is definitely there. It's a stout beer, but it's very delicate and light and silky, and it's just it's almost refreshing. And you took a nice drink of water after a real thirsty day, but instead it's beer, so it's better. The spice is really present, but just very soft. It's like going with the flow of everything. Everything gets to be there. The chocolatiness, the slight dark toastiness, the little notes of caramel on the back, and the pumpkin is just like riding along with it. Even though they're wrestling on here, there's no wrestling with this drink. You're just gonna enjoy it. Good job, Clown Shoes, good job. I'm gonna put you on there. It's been a while since I had some Clown Shoes. Not gonna lie, I'm really trying to expand out. The whole point is explaining this to people who have not had it, want to have it, are deciding on it, or people that are trying to figure out what's their style. Unfortunately, pumpkin is a short season, so you gotta dive in and try some to see if that's what you want next year, or if you feel it, because you'll know immediately. But right now, I'm, I'm a, I just love it, just enjoy it. And so when I see them, I see my go-tos and I pick up a couple of them, but I'm only seeing what's new and what's coming out. So this one I have not had, glad I have it. Hopefully you get to enjoy it. If you don't feel the description or the styles of you, hopefully I've given enough info where you made a decision. But for now, I'm happy. Hopefully you're happy. And we're all happy. But until then, we'll pick another one. Let's just finish off this one. Cheers to that.